How's it going, guys? How's it going? Great. How are you? What's it like to come into a new job and have this kind of talent uh, on the roster? Yeah, it's been a really fun process. Uh, you know, through the whole process, you're, you're kind of getting to know the personnel. And then uh, just the way Howie's obviously handled this offseason has been phenomenal. Just, you know, the pieces we've added uh, to complement the pieces that are already in place. I think it's been a phenomenal setup. We're really, really excited about it. What do you recall from your head coaching interview here? And how much did that, uh, how much was that on your mind when you took the, the OC job? Yeah, really fun process. Uh, really impacted me just how phenomenal the people were. You know, uh, fortunate to get to know, you know, Mr. Lurie, Howie, the whole crew. Uh, they, they had a long, really long, thorough process. It was really impressive. And so obviously those relationships and those conversations extended beyond just that, you know, that day or two. And so, uh, you know, obviously those things, uh, I think, have led us hopefully to something something that where we've had an opportunity to come here and uh, team up with these guys. How's your system different? How's your system different from what Eagles have done here the past three years? Yeah, I think everyone's, everyone's got their different flavor from a systematic approach. I think our real focus here as we've gone through this process is, you know, we got a lot of good going on, and, and we can't lose the good and, and the, the reps that, you know, Jalen and A.J. have developed and Dallas has developed, this offense line have developed, and how can we build off of those things and really c connect the whole thing. And so that, that's been a really fun process. Uh, you know, there'll be tweaks, there'll be changes. Uh, everything's constantly evolving. That, that's part of this whole offseason program. I mean, we just got to our first week of actually being on the field with these guys. Once you get on the field, things just start evolving. And so that, that's really where we're at. We're at a really uh, beginning level of this thing. We're really, really excited to go through this process with phase three, get a little bit more field work. And then really when you get to training camps, when you can really hammer in the run game and the play action game and how all that stuff connects. We talked about having outside ideas. We talked about blending philosophies, finding some of the other answers. What's that blending like? With just kind of what you, what's it like when you guys work together? What do you or just kind of an insight with those experiences? I think it's a really fun process. Fortunately, like most of us who go in this profession, you have different times in your in your career where, you know, whether it's a new coach coming in or you're going to a new place. There's people just have different exposures. And so the more conversations you can have, the more discussion points, hey, we had an issue with this, hey, we had a potential answer, vice versa, and you have that continuous conversation. Uh, it's been really, really fun. I, I, I love the opportunities that we can sit down, we can just talk about things, and uh, I learn from Nick. Hopefully I can bring some things that, uh, you know, people can learn hopefully from just maybe an experience that I've had that, that's different than theirs. I think that's part of this whole process is we got a really, really good coaching staff here. There's you know, there's a good reason. I was fortunate to bring Doug and Kyle, but a lot of guys stayed here because we got a really, really good staff. How does that compare to your previous stops? Like, is it more collaborative? Would you feel like it's a different uh, process to what you've done in the past? Each stop is, you know, really the big emphasis is on collaboration. And so whether it's, you know, when I was fortunate to, to hop into as an OC role, we kind of kept the system in place and kind of made, made our little adjustments when Jason was our head coach. Mike came in in Dallas. We were fortunate to kind of Merge those two worlds together is a really fun process. And then going to L.A. last year, you know, we had a similar thing where, you know, try and keep some of the things that are in place, build off of that, um, and kind of build ultimately what our 2023 last year. And obviously this year our focus is really ultimately what do we want 2024 to look like, you know, whether it comes from 23 or beyond, wherever it comes from, it comes from. You've been quarterback uh, <clears throat> so far. Uh, what are your first impressions of, of Jalen and how is he unique to guys like Dak and Justin? Yeah, I really enjoyed uh, Jalen's process. Uh, you know, so far, I think really it's focused on how he processes the game and just kind of the, the classroom aspect of it. And we're beginning the field process uh, of really getting out on the field and being able to do this thing. But uh, I've, I've really enjoyed our, our conversations. Uh, I think he's, he's a really smart player. He has a great feel for this game. Uh, the more conversation we have, the more we get to make these adjustments and build off of this thing. But Jalen's one of the premier quarterbacks in this league for a reason. And uh, you see it, you know, on film previously, but obviously getting on the field now, uh, you're certainly seeing it.